was grief and sorrow at Salama School for the Blind in Luga Village. In Tanzi Parish in Teja Richsoga Town Council in Mukono District as parents and guardians rushed to the scene on hearing the sad news of the untimely death of 11 young girls after a fire broke out in the girls' dormitory. <laughs> The director of the school, Francis Chinubi, who was at the scene at the time of the fire outbreak, says he suspects someone used the petrol to try to burn down the school. Some of the eyewitnesses that Church of Uganda Family TV talked to explained the incidences that happened as the fire broke out. Parents who were able to get a hold of their children alive say they can't risk leaving their child at the school until investigations on what caused the fire are completed. Hajat Fatuma Ndisaba Nabitaka, the resident district commissioner Mukono has however said the school will not be closed since primary living examinations are just days away. Because some of them are going to do PLE in the coming two weeks, so we cannot say that we are closing the school and the bodies were burnt to fire to ash. There is no one who can be easily recognized. So I know we are going through a process of doing DNA, so we cannot release anybody and police has taken them to Mulago for maybe keeping them till when we get to the parents and government does that process. At the time of filing this report, Kampala Metropolitan Police spokesperson, Senior Superintendent of Police, Patrick Onyango told the Church of Uganda Family TV that the death toll still stands at 11. Good afternoon, Afande. Good afternoon, how are you? Good, this is John from Family TV. Oh. Yes, I'm seeking for an update about the Mukono fire. The investigations are still ongoing. How many people are confirmed dead? I'm told the death toll has raised. That is according to you. We still have 11 dead and 6 injured. So okay. that is the number which is still on, which is still there. Thank you, Afande. Welcome.